All right, my last little hint is how to do composite transformations. That's when you do one, two, maybe three of them, or more even, for that matter. Um, I'm still going to use the same ones I've been using. I, I don't want to give away too many hints because this is part of the fun, is for you to figure out some things on your own. So a composite means to do more than one uh, transformation in a row to still map it onto the other. Let me, let me give you an example. Not that this, I mean, if you can do it in one, hey, uh, it's nice. If it tells you to do it in two or more, you got to find another way. Let me give you some easy thoughts about this. Usually it has to do with a translation as a part of everything else. So you and I did a reflection directly here to here. What happens, though, if I first uh, created a vector, let's say, from C to E, and translated our guy over there. So let's translate this shape by that vector. Now it places it here. Now I, I can now do a reflection. Well now the reflection would be over the perpendicular bisector of, of A prime. This one slid to here and P. And so if I do a perpendicular bisector of that, now I'm able to take this guy. Let me change this guy's color. Uh, let's make him a beautiful orange. That looks good. And I'm able to reflect this one over the new line of reflection. So let's pull out our reflection here. Pick our object and reflect it into spot. And just to get more fun colors, there we go. So I first translated it over and then I reflected it on a new line. That was two. I, I could probably do the same thing here, down to here. Um, I know that D needs to land on N, so I might first do a translation there first. So again, a vector would be helpful. That might take D to N, and I would do a translation there first. So let me pull out translate by my vector. And then when I get it down there, I then need to either do a reflection to make it work, or maybe a translate, a rotation, or something. These are options on how to do these things. Um, there are many ways. There are really, I would say, infinite ways to do this. I mean, you don't have to directly, you can just put it out here and then try and reflect it. There, there are some ways that are more difficult than others, but that was enough to at least get you thinking about how to do this. Good luck. Have some fun with this.